Welcome to Jackie Land. Yeah. Good morning, everybody. We are not having the best start to the morning, so now I'm going to vent to you. <laughs> so I woke up not feeling the best myself because I have a really bad headache, kind of like I had yesterday. Not as bad as yesterday, though, but I have a really bad headache and um, other womanly things are making me not feel great, and I'm a little congested, if you can hear it. Um, so I woke up like that, but I woke up hearing Blizzard shaking his head like over and over and over and over and usually that's the telltale sign that he has ear infections so um <clears throat> we went and looked at his ears and the bone that we got him a couple days ago we weren't sure if he was allergic to but he's allergic to so many things that we figured he probably is but we just give it a try well he definitely is because both of his ears are infected and they're infected so bad that they're actually like i mean it's not like bleed bleeding but there's like red in there too um which could be because he's like he, he's not trying to scratch it but he just like flips his ears and um it kind of like obviously itches it a little bit so poor guy so I wiped his ears out and then started his eardrops that we have lots of on hand so much so that I thought we were out one time so we bought another bottle and forgot that we already had a full bottle so now we have like multiple bottles and they're full so Started his eardrops, which he hates, but at least they heal his ears and then he feels better after. Um, so I took care of that. And then um, last night when we were coming home, someone ran into a pole. Um, like the the electric pole, whatever. And um, we're like, oh my god, at least it's not our apartment because we seem to like go out fairly often. But when I went to take him out to go potty across the street, they're like at our pole. And I'm like, okay, well at least my power's still on, alright. But um, it was like that side of the street, but like a mile and a half down. So maybe it has to do with that. But I'm like, dear god, it's already hot in my house. Please do not let the, like, the power go out. Like... That's one thing I do not need to add to dealing with today with already not feeling great. So then I go take Lizzie potty. It goes fairly smoothly. He barks at the mailman. I feel bad for the mailman. He mostly got scared by him. And then when we come back in, I see water, ice water, spilled all over my table. And I'm like, what the hell? Bird tried to steal my hair tie that I forgot to take off of my cup, and so she spilled my water cup all over the table. Thank God my computer wasn't on the table. Oh my God, I would have died. But, so I had to clean that up, which was fantastic. Fantastic. So, as you can tell, my night is off, to, or my morning is off to a terrific start. <laughs> It, I'm sure it'll get better. It's not that bad. It's just frustrating and all at once and when you're not feeling good You're just like come on. I feel bad for blizzard because your infections are not fun and He hasn't had one in quite a while. He gets um, like Labradors are met like they Get them easier because they have like the big floppy ears um, so it's like totally normal for them to get ear infections quite often plus he has tons of allergies so that ups his chances plus he um plus he has like seasonal allergies so when the seasons change or stuff like that he tends to get them just because of that um like humans get seasonal allergies so there's like so many reasons why he would get them crazy but last night I went to my brother and sister-in-law's house with Quentin and it was so much fun we played risk which I was kind of forced to play I mean I was being a team player and just playing but I'm not a huge fan of the game I feel like it takes a long time you have to be very strategic it's frustrating to me that you lose or win people based on a dice roll which I have proven to be not that great at rolling dice um, like last night I like couldn't roll dice for the life of me. So, um, we played that and then we played Uno and then the funnest thing of all, we went outside and played, uh, it's kind of like Marco Polo, but we went out in the dark and, um, well the dark-ish and we, <laughs> one person had like a bandana on 
And the rest of us were like running around and they had in a somewhat small area, they had to tag another person, but it's hard to do when you're blind and you were just like trying to like sound and hear for where they are. And of course they could see you and they could run. Um, so it was so much fun. And then my brother went first and it's hard. And then he ended up getting me and I went and thankfully they changed the rules so that instead of just like running away from him, the people who were not it had to one at a time go and touch the person who was it to kind of like get close to them type of thing instead of it just being like you just hide. Plus uh, it's their backyard so they know it a little bit better than us but still like there's like a potted plant in the middle and there were like two trees and there's a fence and like if you're blindfolded and trying to run like you could easily just like run into something. Kimmy actually did take out a <laughs> she took out a plant. <laughs> that was kind of funny but um yeah so they started like doing where you would touch them and it was just so much fun. Like, we were, like, such children, and it was so fun because, like, I don't know. I feel like that's such a child game, but it's still fun. And, like, w when you're it is probably the least fun, but it's still funny because you, like, feel so stupid, but it's fun. And the people who aren't it, it's hilarious because, one, you have your adrenaline up when you get near the person. You're just like, oh, my God, I don't want to get it. But then also, like, all the people, like, you're watching them, like, look silly and you communicating with the other people. And it was just so much fun. And we did that for, like, 45 minutes or something. And you're pretty much, like, all of you were, like, running or at least excited. You can hear him flipping his ears. Poor guy. All of them are, are, like, running or at least excited. So, like, your your heart is, like, pumping the whole time. So, it was lovely cardio for all of us <laughs> as we're running around. And look at this. Like, what is going on? I don't get zits. This guy is freaking huge. And then I go down here. It's freaking huge. And what is the deal? What's the deal? I don't know. I feel like because I'm not on birth control anymore, my body's going to go through a phase of just, like, what are we doing? And freak out a little bit. And then I'll get pregnant and we'll have a whole nother what are we doing. Great. <laughs> so yeah, that's what's going on. That's what happened last night and it's going on today. And um, I'm not feeling too great today, so I don't know really what I'm going to do. I need to do some editing, obviously. I should work out today, but if I'm not feeling great, I'm going to try and let myself rest because that was the plan yesterday and then I ended up pushing myself again. Why do I know that? And tomorrow... I work a day earlier because my family that I work for is going on vacation. So I will be working Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday this week. So tomorrow starts my work week, and then I'll have a break on Friday, and then the salon on Saturday. So it's going to be an interesting week, especially since I'm normally with Quentin on Tuesdays, and that won't happen. And he'll have two days off this week by himself because we're the other Tuesday when he's off, and then he's off Wednesday by himself. So... So yeah, I will check in with you guys later, and hopefully have more better things to report. Bye! Today is just not my day. Like, the morning hasn't been great, and I feel, like, worse than I did when I got up. And I uh, edited and did everything for yesterday's vlog today. Went to export it, and something happened with the files, so now... It, like, it thinks they're imported, but they're not really imported. But because it thinks they are, it won't let me, like, delete them and re-import them. Because whenever I try and re-import them, they think they're already imported. So, unfortunately, I have good footage from yesterday that I now think I won't be able to use at all because... Because it won't let me. So, I'm frustrated keep trying to figure out like a way to fix it and it's just not working so I don't know I don't know but I also don't feel good so I'm gonna go back to resting and I have a, I have a phone call I have to take later today and I have to be like sounding at least like I'm on my A game but I'm not 
Merp. Hello, friends. I am at the drive thru of Starbucks for two reasons. One, because I just love Starbucks. And two, um, I took some more ibuprofen, and I've heard that if you like have caffeine with it, it makes it activate faster. And I just feel like total poop today. Like my head hurts so bad. I have such a headache. And like my body feels crappy. And like I don't even know why. <sighs> so that's what's going on. My stuff for my pure romance party came in though. Because she only had one of the things I purchased that night. And then two other things she had to mail to me. So they came in the mail. But I won't be using those today. So that sucks. And tomorrow I have to work early. Gary like told you this, I have to work Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday this week instead of Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. So, whatever this is needs to figure itself out by the morning because I'm not about to be doing the kids shindig shuffle feeling like this. Hmm, it feels like poop. But that's what's going on. Today is gonna be a super poop vlog. Sorry. But that's life. Hey guys! So I'm starting to feel a little bit better-ish. Not like totally though. Um, I decided to push through and try and do a workout and just like really, really modify because felt like I needed to like get my heart going and stuff like that. Um, so I guess I'll find out in a few minutes if that was a good plan or not because it's done. Um, obviously I didn't go super hard because I wasn't trying to like make myself worse but I wanted to do something exercise related. I was sweating a ton which could be good. Maybe I'm like sweating out some yuckiness. I don't know. But um basically been relaxing most of the day and um, talked to the person on the phone and that went good and um, I basically relaxed, ate dinner, worked out and now I'm going to go take a bath. Hopefully like soaking in Epsom salts will kind of help all this too and then Quentin will be home soon and then I'll have to go to bed because uh, my work week starts tomorrow because I'm doing a day early this week, Tuesday through Thursday. And that's pretty much it. So I'm going to sign off for tonight and hope that I feel better by tomorrow. And I will talk to you all tomorrow. And thanks for watching even when my days aren't super exciting. Because that's life, right? Love you guys so much. Bye.